Hey guys, it's King Robert coming to you guys with another video. I've been under the weather, so I'm not going to be posting as much as I, I have. But I did see a uh, OnlyFans um, page for Krishan. And I posted it on my community wall. And just like I guessed, her fans were coming in talking about, are you sure that's her? Well, you should check before you post that that's her. First of all, to have an OnlyFans, because I know people that have them, you have to share your credential. Please stop talking to me like I don't know what I'm talking about. She has to show her credential. And if she didn't, she had somebody had her information, make one. And it's not far fetched from her. She posted a sex tape of her in blue. She's all over um, Twitter, X naked and uh, with the sex tape so what are you guys saying what are you guys saying like it's beneath her like it's impossible stop acting like she's holier than thou she's not she can't keep her hand to herself she doesn't know how to have a conversation as a grown person twice she literally hates people if she doesn't agree with them and you guys will make every excuse in the book it's not going to work all the time see that's why mr law is looking for her because mr law don't care that she grew up dysfunctional mr law don't care if her mom did drugs or not mr law don't care if she had 11 siblings while everybody keeps saying 12 because she, literally it's 11 the other one passed away when she was born little so at the end of the day you guys keep acting like she's beneath she said she's making all this money on snapchat so why the only fans is that the reason why blue is telling her to play with her stuff for him so they could promote their only fans because he's not making any money either he needs her to make money but you guys swear it's love krishan needs real love not the blue blue blues offering Jaden don't need blue either to be honest, they both need to leave him where he's at because he's not good for none of them. But y'all will not promote that. Y'all promoting, oh, he loves her more than, no, he could make more money out of her because he could exploit her more. And that's not love. But you don't want to have that conversation because you'll hear, oh, I used to love somebody. That's not love, sweetheart. That's not love. The, that's not love. And Carlisa, say what you want about Carlisa. She's right. Let him claim the baby first before you call it. She over there calling him daddy. Her and chastity with this daddy thing. And that's how you know they have daddy issues. You calling your grown ass boyfriend daddy. He letting you call him daddy. But your child, he disowns. Like that's some nasty work. And you guys sit there and act like it's to be upheld because he called her his wife. They're not married in Vegas, so don't come on my page talking about, oh, this channel said and that channel said. A lot of channels saying stuff so that they could get the the views and because they know you people are will fall for anything. That's why you don't stand up for nothing. People will fall for anything, and it's grown people that pisses me off. Like, y'all literally will think that somebody got time to lie on this girl. The girl is not an outstanding person. She's not like, it's not like she's a Beyonce, Kelly Rowland, or anybody that keeps their business intact. She puts everything out there. So, an OnlyFans is beneath her? Since when? And don't get me wrong, people are using it to promote different stuff. But she has one. And it ain't music. Y'all can hear her music on YouTube for free. Who's who's calling up the radio station talking about, oh, I want to hear Survive all the time. Y'all post it when it's playing so that she could repost it. But y'all not checking for her music. Right now, she's the laughing stock. You have NL Chapa making music off of her, dissing her. You have Lil Mabu dissing her. You know, had Soldier Boy dissing her. It's like her and Blueface is like a laughing stock. But you guys swear they're the new him and her. No, they need money. What do you think they're doing? He's not making no money. Blueface is a liability to walk. He needs to just tell the truth. He's a liability. He's not getting no real returns off of Blueface. Blueface ain't getting no real returns off of Krishan. Krishan was maybe hot a year ago before she stopped putting her hands on people and thinking it was cute. Her only fans has her pregnant picture. To make it even funnier, it's her pregnant. She has on her picture. But y'all swear everybody's lying on the girl. Keep on swearing people are lying on her. Nobody cares to lie on her. It's just you watching her fall from grace because God pray, she prayed and God got her out, out of her opportunity. But what did she do? Slap him in the face by doing the stupid shit she's doing. You can't go around putting your hands on people. You guys cannot make excuses for her because that's why Mr. Law isn't listening to y'all. Because if it was up to y'all, it would be like, oh, there was no proof with James. The police, rec the police report came out and I see people still talking about, oh, well, there's still lies and oh, Jaden is still like, what? Nobody told her to put her hand on nobody. Are you guys really sick in the head? Are you guys really think you could wish away, excuse away, make up lies away for this girl's behavior? 
It doesn't work like that. See, Mr. Law don't care how she grew up. Mr. Law don't care if her mom and pops wasn't there. Mr. Law don't care if she's angry. Mr. Law don't care. Mr. Law is not blue. See, they're not going to play with her. They're not going to go take her for tech for, with her. They're just going to deal with her. That's why she got to keep on hiding in his pantry. Because she has to go pay for that Oklahoma shit she got going on. Or she just got to pay a liar to get it dismissed one or the other. I don't know, because her PO is asking for the full four years. The judge signed off on 30, but the PO wants the full four years. But y'all keep skipping that part because y'all want to make it seem like, oh, it's nothing. I see people talking about, oh, she paid her, ba- she paid her bail. Oh, she's not getting no money. Oh, all these p- things. No, Krishan's been a menace. Y'all just finding out, but y'all making an excuse for it because she grew up with all this pain and she grew up with all this dysfunctional family. Keep on making excuses. See, the law don't care how you grew up. The law just care that you act according by the law. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Be respectful in the comments.